All right, guys, we are back again with another video, and here is that one I promised you in the last one. Let's talk to... Hello. Can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. Grace Pinch yes. Smedley. My name is <laughs> Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the bath, Pinch Smedley? So essentially, Smedley's? she's going to ask us to go I find something I was hoping someone would come so along swim, soon. we can dive. I was about to defy my father's stuff. wishes and would never have forgiven myself. You see... I need to retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? Diving into the lake sounds like an adventure. Tell me more. Splendid. Precisely the response I'd hoped for. What do you need help retrieving? Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, set sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We only know that neither they nor their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrolabe vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. It sounds dangerous, especially for something of mere sentimental value. I understand. But I'd be forever grateful. Of course, you may discover much more than the astrolabe. Anything else you found would be all yours. I've cross-referenced the vessel's last alleged location against the lake's topography, depth charts and tide schedule. My best guess is that it's just over there, about a furlong from the dock. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's astrolabe back. Hey. I do hope you find the Spoosh astrolabe. Ahoy. It would mean so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. I should dive down and see. See that? That's where we're heading. See those little spots? Those are diving locations. We're looking for something. All right, let's swim fast. This must be where the Pinch Smedley family astrolabe is. Just push in the uh, push in the joystick to swim fast. Here's one diving spot. Search. We dive down. We come up with. Oh, the astrolabe on the first go. And a wigan wall potion. I should let Grace know that I found her family astrolabe. Well, we're going to look for a couple other things because we're here. Rustic guard. Okay, cool. And one more. Oh, no, there's a couple spots. Let's do this one. I can't believe we got the astrolabe on the first hit. Ah, oh, ornate juniper gloves. Okay. Let's head back to the dock, I guess. Unbeatable Quidditch gloves. Nice. And one more. Celtic attire. Nice. There's some good stuff in this dive. And I can go back in. I can. I just am not going to. Probably for a while. I have so many things to do. Let's go, Taylor. We got the Astrolabe. Hey. More swimming. We're almost there. You didn't find the dive too terribly difficult. Oh, shoot. Oh. Hey. Huh. All right. Hello, Grace. I followed your bearings on a dive in the Black Lake. Oh, how incredible! Did you find the astrolabe? I did. Here you are. I did, and it's here for a price. I did, and I'm keeping it. 
There you I are. did. I hope it makes your father happy. No desire it to will. Keep that astrolabe. I you can't, can't wait to see his face. Why? What are you gonna do? Thank you so much Just for doing this for me nah, and ahead. for my Give family. You do well to keep an eye out for more spots to dive. A diver a of, of your stuff. caliber is certain to find all sorts of things down there. Thank right, you again. That is gonna do it and for I do this hope video. you keep There's diving. One thing I wanna do you certainly we have a knack for finding treasure. Of course, like, comment, subscribe. Forget and don't forget every Saturday toy unboxing, every Sunday Pokemon cards, every day of the week we have toy hunt shorts up on the channel. And now the only thing I want to do before we go. Gear. Let's look at what we got for gear. This is a plus 22. This one's a plus 23. And that has nothing. So, we're going 23. Ornate Juniper Gloves. Very nice. Here we have a wand handle. Look at that. Ooh, we get a couple. No, I don't like that. And yes, I do like that. Okay. Face wear. We got a 14, a 6, a 5, and 0. Now. Those are ugly. But what are we going to do with that? Change appearance. We're going to change the appearance of the glasses to... That. So now I have that benefit, but it doesn't look like I'm wearing them. So I did that. Here is an 11 hat, a 6 hat, a 7 hat, and 0 hat. So let's do sheepskin winter hat. <laughs> That's great. And what are we going to do? Change the appearance again and make it look like the hat is invisible. Neckwear. We have one thing for neckwear. Natural beige scarf. We have no need to wear that. It does not provide us a benefit. <coughs> Cloaks and robes. A 10 and a 10. A 5 and so... That one is nice, but it looks like a Slytherin outfit. This one's nice. Uh, let's save that for now. Okay, you know what? And now we have Celtic Attire 22. It's a 17, and that's a zero. Okay. Prefect mission. Okay. 17. Okay, cool. I'm not a big fan of the outfit, but for now, that'll do. All right, guys, don't forget all those things I told you before. We'll see you again tomorrow with another video.